Guards Fulu coming to you with another video. Shout out to the whole LDBC. I just want to show you guys this. Right now I'm in Torrance right now. And you know what I find quite odd? They're protesting. Having a protest in Torrance. No social distancing. No um, mask. Some people are not wearing masks. They're all lined up over there. With, with the van and what have you. And I'm just wondering, okay, where did COVID-19 go? And as you see, most of the protesters are white, okay? I just want to say something, man. I really, as I said in the last video, think that this is a social engineering project, okay? I... You know, it just really, something is not sitting right with me, with this. And I'm going to tell you another thing. I was in Long Beach, right? I'm going to tell you something. The restaurants were open. People were dining. No face masks while they were dining. People were sitting down to dine. The beaches were filled. The parks were filled as if the thing just went ahead and disappeared okay I still have my guard up and I still have my reservations about this okay I really do you see that protest over there that I just passed and they protested in front of a eye, a eye place right like eyeglass place and there, and it just boggles my mind that there was no social distancing and there was no I mean some people didn't have masks on that's the thing you know what I'm going to still observe and I'm going to uh, you know I the way I fit into this I guess you can say I'm public re relations I know how to write articles and things of that nature and I know how to uh, you know, cover things, you know, but if, if the, I, I said it before, I said it again, if the goals are clear, if everything is concrete, then you can count on me to be front line with it. Okay. Uh, I know it sounds crazy and you know, please, whoever's watching in the bushes, don't flag this video. But if someone were to say that we were going to establish a new government or something like that a government in which the power actually is given to the people and the goals were clear concise or if someone told me that we were going to establish an autonomous black community where blacks from every walk of life and from every different culture being you know continental african being caribbean being uh afro-latin being descendant uh, African born here. You know, I'm not going to say African American. I'm just going to say uh, African descendant uh, whose roots are have been by here for a couple of uh, hundreds of years or what have you. Then I that's what I'm going to be front line for. You know what I mean? That's what I would be on the front line. But I'm, I'm just going to play it by ear, man. Because, you know, I'm going to say one thing. Either one, the COVID cases are being underreported. Or two, they're really main. I mean, I'm not going to jump the broom. But maybe there is not, it's not as severe as people were making it out to be. Well, anyhow, you know, my bad if the video quality is bad, but I, this has been on my mind for some time now, you know what I mean, about this whole thing. And I, I'm, I'm just trying to figure it out, you know, I'm really trying to figure out this whole thing. I know it's a spiritual aspect to it, you know, because here's the thing about Torrance. Torrance is very, very racist. You know, Manhattan Beach is very, very racist. Hermosa Beach is very, very racist. I mean, the South Bay cities are very, very racist. So I'm just trying to figure out what would compel them to do a protest, you know? 
condemning police brutality when a lot of them are hardcore Trump supporters. You know, I'm really trying to figure this out. And hopefully I will figure it out sooner or later. But anyhow, man, leave your thoughts and leave your comments about the whole thing. Fool is signing out. I'm Jada.